My name is Jessica Cervantes. I work for a company called Brockets Film Fauna. We specialize in all kinds of animals from the very small to the very large. Today I'm snail wrangling. We have some hero snails that are in the scene on the maze moving around and also lots of extra snails in the jar just hanging out for background. We definitely have a couple little tricks on how to, how to make snails move and uh, go in the directions we want. Um, temperature is always really important with animals like this. If you cool them off, they'll slow down and if you warm them up, they'll tend to move a lot faster. Um, they'll also have a natural instinct to get out of water. So if they're not moving and you place them in a little bit of shallow water and then lift them out, they'll start to move because they have that instinct to get away from the water. They'll drown in water. Once he sticks his antenna out, he actually has, his eyes are at the end of those antennae. Um, they're prey animals. They don't eat meat, they eat vegetation. And we have a little saying called, um, eyes on the side made to hide, eyes in front made to hunt. So these guys actually have their eyes on the side and can move them around in different directions. And uh, of course, if they're threatened by a predator, they will retract into their shells. A lot of animals um, that'll eat these are things like raccoons, possums, uh, even some birds of prey, and they can can break the shell open and eat them. And of course, humans eat escargot, but not these particular type of snails. 